Hello students, welcome back to our class. Today we will look at a new unit that is Unit 8, Share Your Views. In this unit, you will look at advertisements for different purposes, focus on persuasive language and how it can be used to express an opinion, send a message or give a point of view. You will also see how to analyze film reviews and to write a letter. The subtopics are Analyze a poster Sound persuasive Compare posters Give information Talk about films Analyze film reviews How to present an oral review and Informal or formal our first topic, analyze a poster. What is a poster? Well, a poster is a temporary promotion of an idea, product or event put up in a public space for mass consumption. Typically, posters include both the textual and graphic elements, although a poster may be either wholly graphical or wholly text. They are designed to be both eye-catching and informative. The features of a poster are eye-catching design, that is, it should catch the reader's attention. Large font, that is, the size and shape of the print should be visible from a distance. The key heading, that is, the main message. Catchy slogan, which is used for effect. Persuasive language, that is, sparing an effective use of vocabulary to convey a message. Factual information, that is, the information of the dates, time, place. And appeal to a specific audience, which is the purpose of the poster and the age of the audience. Now note that, a poster should provide details and use keywords and not full sentences for effect. Keywords are easy to read and can be displayed boldly because there is enough space on the page. The second topic, sound persuasive. Persuasive devices are used in written text and also in how we speak and use body language. Someone who speaks enthusiastically can draw others in and grab attention. Persuasive language can exaggerate a truth, so we should learn to be persuasive without distorting the truth by choosing the correct words. Let us look at some examples. The first example, the carnival is open to the whole world or young and old. Here, the carnival is open to the whole world sounds the most positive, while the carnival is open to the young and old sounds positive but realistic. The second example, at the carnival, you will find everything your heart desires or something for everyone. The sentence, at the carnival, you will find everything your heart desires sounds the most positive. While at the carnival, you will find something for everyone sounds positive but realistic. The third example, come and have the time of your life or lots of fun. The sentence, come and have the time of your life sounds the most positive, whereas the sentence, come and have lots of fun sounds positive but realistic. Now, when you look at the advertisements about the holiday of a lifetime given on page 119, you will find how persuasive language can distort or exaggerate the truth. The language in the second advertisement is persuasive and actually misleading because it is trying to make the place sound better than it is. The third topic, compare posters. Here, when you look at the poster, 
doubling mountaineer bus service on page 120 you should focus on the pictures and headings and any other clues that will put the text into context the doubling mountaineer is the name of the bus this poster is advertising a bus service that is it gives details of the name time and route of the bus service the fourth and fifth topic finding information here a map is given on page 122 go over it follow the dotted line look for the city find the mountains and read through the questions to help you put the map into context this map will be a useful addition to the poster on page 120 because of the extra details it provides now let us look at preposition prepositions show the relationship of one thing to another they are followed by a noun proper noun pronoun or gerund which is a verb in a noun form with ing at the end example swimming driving etc a sentence may contain more than one preposition for example get into the bus and sit behind the driver here the prepositions are into and behind now avoid ending a sentence with a preposition example this is the place i was thinking of instead say i was thinking of this place prepositions are also used in figurative expressions example he drove me around the band here it means he made you very angry or bored the second example i'm between a rock and a hard place it means to be in a very difficult situation and to have to make a hard decision now remember that use of an incorrect preposition will change the meaning and the direction will be incorrect the sixth topic talk about films we all have a personal view of a film when we share our views about a film we enjoy we may instill an interest on others about the film here you should be able to identify the genre of the film posters given on page 125 film posters give us an idea of what to expect in the film and try to persuade us to watch it some of the informative details and persuasive devices we find in this posters are award details actor details pictures of characters and events colors print size and style and age details etc the seventh and eighth topic analyze film reviews film reviews give an opinion about a film when you look at the reviews of the two flames whale rider and hugo you will find that the reviews have all the features in common now remember that a personal opinion is not fact a personal opinion can be positive or negative we can accept others opinion as valid but it is not necessary that we have to agree with it we may enjoy a film but that does not mean everyone else will also enjoy it the ninth and tenth topic present an oral review choose a film that you have seen or want to see it can be one of the films mentioned in this unit then list the basic information about the film that is the title genre age restriction time and then make a commentary notes that is personal view of a film about the plot the setting the characters and other aspects like the music the commentary notes should express a personal opinion for example the characters were portrayed exactly as i had imagined them from the book use persuasive techniques like powerful vocabulary interesting facts 
and a personal opinion. You can also rate the film. You can be creative and come up with any suitable ratings like stars, smileys, etc. Once your notes are complete, use keywords to summarize your review onto speech cards. Then practice your speech aloud. Present your speech with confidence. Remember, body language is an important part of communication. If you stand like this, you are communicating that you are shy, scared or not interested. But if you stand in this way, you are communicating that you are interested and confident about what you are saying. The 11th and 12th topic, informal or formal. In the past, people communicated with friends or family living far away by way of writing letters. Today, emails have become a popular form of letter writing. It is an informal means of communication often used by adults, but some emails are used for formal means of communication and have a formal tone, a fairly relaxed structure and tone. When you look at the example of an email on page 130, you will notice the use of contractions. Contractions are formed when words are joined to make them short. One or more letters are removed and we use an apostrophe to show where these letters were removed. Example, I will is shortened to al. Cannot is shortened to can't. We can use contractions in an informal writing but avoid use of contractions in formal writing. You will also see the use of two abbreviations used in the email. First, RSVP. It is a French word for please answer. It is used at the end of invitations to request a response. The second, ASAP. It is an abbreviation for as soon as possible. Now, when it comes to letters, we have formal and informal letters. The format of formal and informal letter is already given in the PowerPoint presentation. So, go through both the formats and compare them. Remember, a formal letter has a clear structure and the tone is formal. With this, we come to the end of this unit. Until then, take care and stay safe.